Eat delicious and lose weight with Chef Pachi. Hi, this is Chef Pachi, and today I have an amazing recipe for two sauces with roasted bell peppers. We can use these sauces for many, many foods. First thing we're going to do is we're going to roast two bell peppers. And if you want to make double the sauce, we'll roast four bell peppers. When I roast multiple bell peppers at a time, I usually bake them at 450 degrees for 30 minutes, 35 minutes. Standing so that that way they can roast all over. If I roast them, one or two at the most, I broil them and it takes about five minutes altogether. Every minute you have to turn them so that all of the sides get blackened and roasted at the same time. This is because they are usually standing right below the broiler and they cook very fast. After you take them out, you cover the peppers, then you can even store your bell peppers in the refrigerator for one, two days, a week, or place them in olive oil. This is amazing. And then you can peel them at the end, or you can peel them at once and then store them. Either way, they work perfectly. Now that we've peeled our bell peppers, we open them up and all of the seeds are there for you to remove. Check it out, it's like a little bulb. You remove the bulb with the seeds and they're all out of the way. Now we have our bell peppers ready to create our delicious roasted and smoky sauces. So the first thing we're going to do is place a roasted bell pepper into a blender. And to each bell pepper we're going to add half a cup of plain yogurt. Then we're going to decide what we do with each one at the end. So once we have a bell pepper with half a cup of yogurt, or two bell peppers with one cup of yogurt, we're gonna blend them until we have a smooth mixture. I'm gonna start with a spicy bell pepper sauce. And here, I'm gonna use setar, and I'm gonna use a pinch of salt. That's it. Setar is a Mediterranean spice that is delicious, and it can be found in Mediterranean markets or also in restaurants where some chefs make them themselves. Keep it refrigerated because even though it's some dry spices and seeds, it is amazing and it will keep its flavor perfectly. Check it out, I keep it in a sealed container and refrigerate. So I add a teaspoon of setar and a half a teaspoon of salt to my cup of yogurt mix. And this is it, sauce number one. We blend it again, or you mix it with a fork. It's better to blend it so that all that salt and spice blends perfectly into our mixture. And we're ready with sauce number one. Now, sauce number two is gonna have the pesto. Now we're gonna start our pesto sauce. For our pesto sauce, I use concentrated pesto that I keep frozen. In case you don't have it, you can use commercial pesto or pesto you made and use four tablespoons. I use that's concentrated cubes, so I only need to use a cube. Now going back to where we started, we're going to add the other bell pepper and the other half a cup of yogurt into the blender. Once we blend this, we are gonna be ready to go to the second part, which is adding our pesto. In the meantime, while we blend this, our cube that was frozen is gonna start to defrost. So all you have to do is place it into your container that you're gonna serve or keep, and add your pesto cube. Here we're gonna add a quarter teaspoon of pepper, and I'm gonna use a pinch of salt and mix with a fork. And that's it, you have two 
amazing and delicious roasted sauces, roasted bell pepper sauces for many meals. You can use them with salads, you can use them with appetizers and serve them with different kinds of foods. Scroll down for the recipe, you can print it. Remember, with Chef Pachi, delicious diets are sustainable diets. Subscribe and turn on the bell for recipe updates.